Hello and welcome back to me playing some Final Fantasy X. Um, I decided to try and get him. I think I'm about to do it. Yes, he's got 5,000 hit points left, so I should be able to knock him off now. No, no. All right. Uh, oh, I know why. Oh, hang on a second. Let me item. I need to ether you. There. Okay, so this should work. White haste. Alright, so we'll attack you. Still got 5,000 hit points left, so that's good. Um, Alright, so skill, delay attack. All right. No. I'm really this is not working out so well. I'm really trying to get him to knock off the edge. Okay. Cure the Chocobo Eater. Actually, let me cure Titus real quick. We attack. <laughs> That's why I love Delay Attack. It's such a great ability. Oh, 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 this is my opportunity. Yes, don't care. <gasps> there it goes. Yes. That was so much harder than it really needed to be. Okay. Whew. Level one key sphere. Two of them. Perfect. Oh my gosh. That was so that was so difficult. Have you an interest in renting some chocobos? As a token of our gratitude. The first time is free of charge. Please, ask the attendant if you wish to rent. Thank you so much for saving the chocobos. All right. Oh, that was so much better. Okay. <laughs> oh. Um, thank you, Big Baby J. Uh, he also gave me a little bit of advice. He said that haste was the key, and I don't think it was as key as... Actually, my thought of using Yuna to heal the enemy, but it was definitely very important because the fact that I had so many extra attacks and so many um, delay attacks was delay attacks was also really good. Yeah, we just so much better. All right, um, do I want to rent a chocobo? Uh, chocobos can go and fly on things, I think. Oh, yeah, let me ride one. Alright. Somehow you get you can get over there, but I don't remember how. Let's listen to the music real quick.
It's kind of a unique uh, Chocobo theme. Okay, there it goes. Alright, jump Chocobos, jump! Somehow I can get them to jump. Oopsie. Oh, I can just get on them again. Okay. Whew. This isn't like previous ones where they run away. Um, nope, we will definitely get off for this get to these two. Oh, please. We are currently traveling a part of the Mehan High Road called the New Road. Naturally, that suggests that there is or was an old road. Um. The road that runs below this new road is the original Mehan High Road. Hence, the road that Lord Mehan walked is not this road, but the old road. The new road was built to replace the old road destroyed by sin 500 years ago. But sometimes, standing on the old road and reminiscing about the past can be a pleasurable pastime. The new road was built to replace the old road. Okay. But sometimes, standing... Yeah, we'll just kind of run. That's fine. I don't... I'm not that concerned with being riding a chocobo. This is actually the group that I was kept leveling up with her. Um, we're gonna special. We're gonna cheer. Let's give them all we got. Because we can go like this and summon Ifrit. Because. Quite literally, every attack that they do is fire. They cannot hurt him. They literally heal him. <laughs> it's great. Um, I wonder when I get to give my summons abilities. Oh, we're out of fire. At some point, you can actually give your summons abilities, but I can't remember when. Right, what's this? Okay, so that's... Uh, we're gonna go down to the old road. Save. Um, if you actually get knocked off, because uh, I in the yesterday's episode, uh, you would have seen me get knocked backwards. You, if the chocobo eater actually does knock you off the edge, he knocks you down to the old road, and you just make your way over here that from that road. But Uh, looks like an electric flan. Uh, we're just gonna cheer. Because I'm just gonna summon Ifrit again. Be strong. Meteor strike. Yeah, we want to kill him first.
because he won't heal if <laughs> everybody else does. And full health, perfect. Boom. Boom, and dead. <laughs> Ooh, a red ring. My wife and I have been watching uh, Fallout. Uh, I've been really enjoying Fallout. Uh, it's, it is quite a lot of fun. Oh, and he gets more health. Uh, that's magic break, I believe. Yep. All right, you in there. Oh, I really should actually grab a... Wait, what's this? Chocobo feather. Uh, I should grab Kamari. And Lulu. Black magic, fire? What's he weak to? He's weak to water. Don't know why he's weak to water, but... I mean, I guess water is weak to lightning, so he has to be weak to water. Yeah, but I'm going this direction. Is there anything over this direction? Okay, well. Uh, water, you. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause it. If I find anything interesting down this road, then I will come back. Otherwise, I will meet you back up at the gate. So I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Uh, the only thing at the end, it seems, is a chest, uh, which I will grab real quick. Um... I don't remember what that is. <laughs> it's Mars Crest? I think it's a key item, isn't it? Yeah, Moon Crest, okay. Celestial token fashion in the shape of Mars. Plant used to start fires, okay. I mean, it's kind of neat. Auto, perfect. All right, uh, that's the only thing, so I'm gonna pause it again and meet you back at the gate. All right, I'm back uh, because I just occurred to me that I think that's how you, that it was those chocobo feathers I kept finding on the ground. I found a few of them. Um, that was how you get up to things, and apparently that's true. So I went and grabbed my chocobo. And, yeah, so you just press uh, accept or circle, in my case, on that feather, and he'll actually jump up there. 
So, because I saw another feather. Uh, let's see here. Should be over here. It's the sequel that you can just do that innately. That you can do the jumping thing. Fortune Sphere. Uh, those were the only two I found, so... Uh, it should be fine, no. So... Since this is... <laughs> I turned encounters off just to get back here quicker. Uh, but I should be able to... Hop off now. Alright, we're gonna save it. Save... At the end of the road. All right, who's the gate captain? Data and loser reporting, sir. This is the last of them. Good to have you with us. Go on through. Show me how to play Blitz sometime. Wait around. We'll have Sin beaten in no time. I like the Crusaders more than I like Yevon. In their case, they believe that the in donation toward Operation Meehan would be greatly appreciated. Okay, curiosity has me. Uh give me a second. Uh Let's see. Give me a second. I'll be right back. All right. I looked it up. Nothing interesting. Uh, but I also looked up that I missed a uh, primer back here. Hey, you get back here, bird. Thank you. Move the mouse off to the side. There's apparently an Albert primer right here. Perfect. E to I. Perfect. All right, now uh, let's continue on. You have to leave your chocobos here. Come on, everyone off. Hey, you're a summoner and her guardians, right? Sorry for the inconvenience. Thank you for your cooperation. Hey, no worries. Hey, you're a... What, they didn't tell you? Nope. We're bringing Sin Spawn from all over Spira here. Sin Spawn inevitably draws Sin, right? We're going to lure it into a trap. I'm sorry, I can't let you pass. Mr. Seymour. I had to think about his name for a second. So, we meet again, Lady Yuna. I yes? You look troubled. Is there anything I can do? Well... Mr. Seymour, let me show you to the command center. Hold, I have a request. Yes, Your Grace. I need to have Summoner Yuna and her guardians let through to the command center. But, but Mr. Seymour, Mr. Seymour, sir. Do not worry. I will take full responsibility. Remember, get that in writing. Always get big decisions like that in writing. It is done. Oh, thank you, Your Grace. All right, now we can continue on. Yuna, it's time to go. Oh, right. Who 
does he think he is? He's a maester. Better get used to it, yeah? Right, they are actually fairly high up in the church. Yeah, the, uh... So she's another summoner. What summons does she have? I assume she has Ifrit, because that would be her main place. All hail, Maester Seymour. Did she go to Besaid and get the bird? Brave crusaders of Spira, protectors of all Spira. Believe in the path you have chosen. Let faith be your strength. I, Seymour Guado, Maester of Yevon, will bear witness to your deeds today. Sir! What's going on? Why is Maester Seymour back in the Crusaders, eh? They're using Albed's machina. They're violating the teachings. Even going against the teachings, they're willing to risk it for the greater good. The greater well, good. I think Maester Seymour sees that too. <laughs> Lulu! Hmm. I can only speculate. Ask him yourself. Ah, Sir Oren. It is an honor. I would be most interested in hearing what you've been doing these past ten years. I've got nothing to say about it. I see. Sir Oren must be a great asset as a guardian. Your Grace. Please, there's no need for formalities. Excuse me, Maester Seymour. Why is your lordship presently present here, sir? Please, speak as you normally would. Uh, isn't this operation against the teachings of Yevon? Aren't you going to stop them? It's true. I should. Mm -hmm. However... Both the Crusaders and the Albed truly wish peace for Spira. This Operation Meathead was born from that wish they share. Although it may be sacrilege to Yevon, their intentions are pure. And I, Seymour Guado, the person, not the Maester of Yevon, as a denizen of Spira, I wish them well in their endeavor. But using Machina, that's bad, isn't it? Pretend you didn't see them. <laughs> I beg your pardon, but that's not something a maester should say. Then pretend I didn't say it. <laughs> You're kidding. From the first time I laid eyes on him, I never did like Seymour. But you know, some of the things he said that day, they made a lot of sense to me. They do make a lot of sense. If you're going to kill... If Sin is killing people in the world, and all your teachings are doing is basically having a calm ever, for so many years, I love it, the fact that these people are just giving me items. Ah, um. But these other people are just willing to try and kill off Sin. I love that. That's so great. No. That's fine. <laughs> he hit himself. Piece of cake. Uh, but yeah, I like I like this operation for that reason. Is if they can kill Sin, they will kill Sin. They will attempt it, and I am all for that. Uh, but yeah, we're actually gonna call it here for an episode. Um, thank you all for joining me on this adventure. Do be careful out there. It is now summer, so...
do be careful out there. It is getting hot. Stay hydrated. Stay safe. Use sunscreen. Do whatever you must to stay safe. And then we will see you in the next episode. Bye now.